Hello, welcome to episode 38 of my Final Fantasy VII Let's Play. Uh, this is not a blind Let's Play, so fair warning that spoilers could be incoming. Uh, this game, like many from the late 90s, uh, has a very philosophical and deep and layered plot, not unlike maybe The Matrix or Donnie Darko or Lord of the Rings. So every time I play through it, I tend to catch new things. And if I catch some kind of foreshadowing that I've never caught before, uh, I won't hesitate to reference events in the game that haven't happened yet. Uh, it hasn't happened too many times throughout this run, but it could happen. So just fair warning on that. Um, got a, a nice comment from uh, a young lady today on one of my prior videos. Uh, she said she was quite enjoying it. And then she was talking about how much she loves uh, Final Fantasy VII Remake and how she wants to grab a PS5 so that she can play Rebirth. And I had to, <laughs> I had to unfortunately let her know that I don't uh, don't love... Well, I, I only made it about 10 hours into Final Fantasy VII Remake. It's just a few things bothered me. The way I felt the character's personalities changed, uh, the, the gameplay style change uh, just wasn't exactly my cup of tea maybe i will get back to it one day certainly i would be interested in knowing more about how the story has changed i've kind of heard some stuff about how it's changed i don't know i'm oh, i try to be positive minded about things but anyway i wasn't saying that to her to you know be a spoil sport i'm glad that she enjoys it but uh, if she winds up watching this whole series, she'll wind up hearing anyway, you know, the things that I, I didn't like about it in my playthrough of it. And who knows? People uh, people are very polarized these days. So who knows if she will just, like, hate me for, for not liking a game that she hated. Hopefully not. But I, I was very grateful for her comment of her saying that she was enjoying what I had going on here. So anyway, anyway, hopefully I haven't... Alienated a new potential uh, fan. <laughs> it is what it is. It is what it is, but no, no harm intended. Anyway. Uh, so, I am going to... I am going to swap somebody out for Yuffie and try and go uh, finish uh, Wutai here. I believe I can just... I mean, who should I swap out for? I guess I should swap out Red 13 for a minute. So let's unequip the ribbon. Maybe. Uh, I'll, I'll leave him with the wizard bracelet, whatever. I think that's fine. Um, let's. Right, so Tifa is mandatory. Everybody else, not so much. Boom. Put her in the back. Oh man, I just went for a walk outside. It was so friggin' beautiful. I was wearing running shoes and I went into the woods behind my house and that was like immediately a bad idea because it's been so rainy lately. I forgot that I should have worn boots. But uh, So I just went for a short walk in the woods and then just kind of walked around the neighborhood. And I went to the grocery store, grabbed some, just some snacks and some stuff. God, the fucking sun feels nice. Um, okay, so what do I need on my good friend Yuffie here? -na 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 -na. What a friggin' sick piece of music this is. Okay, so we're just gonna do a one to wait. Let, let's let's get her equipped with the best stuff she can have. And Viper. Let, let's go to the store in town. See if we can get something better for her. Uh, let's make sure I got a good piece of armor for her. Pretty sure I should have something pretty excellent. Yeah, the fire. Fire armlet sounds great. So I won't be able to put everything that Red's got onto her, but I can put the, you know, the essentials. Razor ring. Sounds great. Sounds great. Okay. Wait, why does she have gold armlet? We want fire. Boom. Okay. Change. Alright, well, we'll do a straight up swap. So we definitely want long range. Magic plus. Restore all. Barrier all is pretty important. 
I don't even know what limit break she has. Revive is super crucial. And then I would say... Uh... I could do... I could... Whoops. Oh, I could... Damn it. Let's find revive in here. Could do revive there. And then we could do... Do heal all. I mean, I would love to have uh, Bahamut with HP absorb all. But... I think it's more important to have heal just in case somebody's throwing crazy uh, status ailments onto me. And, uh, and that's it. Only level 37, eh? So they keep the characters kind of leveled up with you, but not totally leveled up. Not totally caught up. I like that. I can appreciate that. It, it, would, it would feel bad to have characters, like, way behind that you had to super power level in order to use. But it would also feel bad to have the characters that you were using the whole time be, like, not not ahead at all. It would be like, well, what was the point of leveling them at all? Um, okay. Let's save up. And let's hope I have what it takes to take uh, this thing out. I, I feel like I should, but I feel like it'll be hard. I'm pretty sure it's like five battles in a row with no, no leaving in between. I do believe that's how this goes. Let's find out. God, I'm paranoid again that I didn't start recording. I always get paranoid uh, recording on this PS4 because it doesn't give you... The, it just needs a blinking red light in the corner to let you know, hey, something's recording. You know, like an, on an old school VCR or camcorder. Like, mm, I get so freaking paranoid that I didn't start recording, even though I always did. I haven't screwed this up even once, but I don't want to get arrogant and, and then screw it up. So anyway, oh, Miss Yuffie, will you be climbing the pagoda today? Oh, yeah. Then I, Sacred Gorky, will be your opponent on the first floor. All right, Sacred Gorky. That's kind of a funny-sounding name, but right on, dude. Yo, they call me Shake. I'll be watching your fight with Gorky. Then begin. I'm pretty sure each person that watches you fight is the person you wind up fighting in the next room. Let's go. Let's go, Sacred Gorky. Gorky Malorky. Power change. Okay. It's got to... Oh! Oh, it's just Yuffie. Oh, are you serious? Uh... Well, not... This is not... Not the worst, honestly. I... I wish I... Okay, if... Oh, my goodness. If I fail this, I will obviously, um... Reconstitute myself. Really, all I'm missing is haste. Everything else is pretty excellent. Let's just go for the limit break. The more time I can take up, like if I had an even longer animation thing to do, she would be able to heal even more via regen, which is amazing. So if I regen barrier or magic barrier, that might be enough to get me through all these. I really wish I could figure out where... Oh, it shows barrier! No way! I didn't realize it showed um, barrier. Oh, and it shows a timer running out. Magic barrier. Wow. Interesting. Um, okay, let's just attack. Oh, and my regen ran out. So I gotta, I gotta re-regen. Re Dude, this thing's regening itself. God, that sucks. Okay, I might scrap the barrier and the magic barrier then. So I, I need to get some attacks in. Let's, let's grease lightning. I, I need to take this thing out. Wow, I am not set up for this. I really wish I could remember where to buy the HP plus or MP plus materials. If anybody can remember that um, and wants to let me know, I, I don't love having to look things up. I would prefer to just hear it from people. I'll look up stuff that's like crucial. Like, uh, I think there's only one thing I looked up in this run so far and I can't even remember what it was. Anyway. Haste would be so nice right now. Okay, there goes my regen. Let's re-up it. Gorky's skill power is used up. Ha ha. Mine's not. Don't you have any, uh... Ethers there, Gorky? Grease lightning. Boom. Let's go. Dude, this is gonna be so hard. Soloing it just with Yuffie. I wonder if I'll get a chance to uh, change her materia in between battles. Let's po 
potion. Here I am, Miss Yuffie. Of course. Hmm, I thought you were just a girl, but you handled that pretty good. Oh, snap. Oh, snap. Is she gonna be like Eris and be like, Just a girl! I'll show you! Let's see what you do on the next one. Okay. Alright. <laughs> okay, well, let's change things up here. So let's give her the absolute best stuff that I've got. I didn't even equip her with a thingamajig. Okay, Bolt Armlet, Aurora Armlet. Is there anything better to equip her with? Not really, unless I value Materia more than anything else. Um, yeah, I feel like th I feel like nothing's gonna be better across the board than Ribbon, other than maybe Choco Feather, if that's gonna make me go even faster. I feel like Ribbon is so valuable, though. I could get so screwed by status ailments. No, don't end game. Okay, so... Oh, I don't even have regular potions. Uh... <laughs> well, since I'm gonna... Okay, yeah, I'll use high potions. And then I've gotta ether her up. But at least I can buy ethers now, so... I, I don't even mind if I have to use up all my ethers, turbo ethers, everything. If I can get her through this challenge... Then that will be fine. Uh, I don't know if her, the order matters. Let, let's just put her up. No, let's keep her in the back, just in case it's keeping her in the back. That does help. Just keep her with the long range materia. Long range only is one level, so that's fine. Okay, magic plus. Do I really need magic plus? I might be able to get away without that. Okay, heal. I don't need any of the alls right now. So let's let's have. Restore. Like, barrier. I don't know that I'm gonna need that. Really, like, I want, like... Okay. Here's what I'm gonna do so this doesn't get too confusing to me. I'm gonna put anything I'm not using back onto red. The all. The all. The all. Whoops. Yeah, I don't... Oh, yeah, duh. I don't need heal when I have a ribbon. So, yeah, heal all, that's fine. Um, revive. Useless. I could do Bahamut plus HP Absorb. That sounds great. Even though I can only use it once, no biggie. That, that will help a lot. Um, okay, so Magic Plus, Long Range. Uh, I, I guess Magic Plus will still help. Yeah, barrier, not really needed. Restore is amazing. Let's put barrier back on him. Let's steal time. Uh, MP absorb. I could do MP absorb. No. Added effect. No. Elemental. No. MP turbo. No. Okay, so really I've just stolen the time magic from Tifa. Okay, so we have Restore. For, ho hopefully Regen is enough to just keep me um, healed. Especially if I can do stuff with long animations. Like maybe a sh is there one that's even... Uh, like I could give her... I mean, I don't want to... Uh, yeah, I guess I don't want to blow through all her MP. What else could I have? Oh, I do want to put enemy skill on her for the last one, so that's fine. Um, put luck plus on her, maybe. A, a counter attack that might be good. Plus, sure. Okay. I'm happy with that. Let's let's try it. I mean, that one wasn't that hard, but it wasn't that easy either. It was only the first one. Who's next? Are you blind? I'm right here. What? I gotta fight a punk? Heh, <laughs> punk. I'm more of an adult than some bimbo girl. Oh, snap. What did you say? 
See what I mean? That kind of anger is what makes you so immature. Oh, okay, okay. Got to control your anger there, Yuffie. Sorry, I'm just open up some pop. Drink some orange pop to power up my my inner strength. That's my orange materia. <laughs> See, I love this. Like, it, it, the little character, the little kid is, like, trolling Yuffie. But it's also, you know, you can take something from that. You as the player, even if you're not thinking about it consciously, it's influencing your mind to constantly be seeing these little tidbits of wisdom that actually do apply to real life. Like, you don't want to let your anger overcome you. Don't pat yourself on the back until you beat me. Yeah, don't count your uh, eggs before they're hatched. Now watch. About the only thing you do really good is breathe. <laughs> Are you sure you want to bite? Uh, stop yapping. Hmm, so someone finally got past Gorky. That reminds me of uh, Polsky O Gorky Pickles. Freaking love a good dill pickle. I guess it's Chekhov's turn. Here I go, Brat Speed Change! Okay, so what we had, like, power change was the first one. Now we have speed change, so this one's more focused on speed. Well, good thing I... Good thing I haste it up. We'll haste up. We'll regen up. So hopefully with haste, I'll at least match their speed. Okay, regen. That's super, super crucial. And then we'll hit the limit break, and then we'll go for Bahamut. What, what other spells do I have? Oh, I could try and slow them. I mean, might not work. Might be a waste. Boom. Oh, nope, 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 nope. Let's go. Ugh, oh, it. Oh, yeah, we got the counterattack in. Boom. Okay. We're, we're set up quite well. This feels like it's going well. So there could be one that's like a magic one. Maybe there's going to be one that physical attacks don't do much on. Uh, which will be unfortunate, but I do have enemy skill, so that will help in a lot in that case. Turbo Ether, frickin' right. Rah! So you can fight a bit. Hey, weren't you just telling me to control my anger? Of course. Ho ho ho, it's been a while since I felt pain. Okay, so the new one. Check off. So we got Gorky, Shake, Check off. It's like different different nationalities. We got, like, Russian, Gorky, like, maybe that is, like, a Polish kind of thing. Shake, uh, uh, I don't know, Middle Eastern? Like, like a, sh like a, like a shake? Like a sheik? Who's gonna watch us now? So even Shake's been defeated. It's been a while since you had to fight, eh, Chekhov? Unfortunately, this is as far as it goes. Staniv, you watch over there. Okay, Staniv, that's also kind of like Eastern European Russian-ish sounding. That ain't going to happen. I'll teach you about the strength of youth. Keep mouthing off like that little girl and you're going to get burned. <laughs> I got insurance. Ho ho ho. We'll see if you still talk like that after you taste some of my sacred magic. Okay, magic change. Okay, so we got power, speed, and magic. Magique. Sac Magique. Shout out to all the Canadians out there who catch that reference. Haste. Haste up. Good gen. Hey, what are you about to do to me? I'm getting nervous that you're not doing anything. Let's just Bahamut you and end the battle. Ba -na -na -na. Ah, uh, doing this is getting me hyped up and making me want to, like, actually do the battle arena. Maybe once I'm, like, at the end, end of the game. Like, right before the final boss. Oh, look, I'm down to no MP. Oh, I forgot to restore my MP between battles. Crap. Okay, let's, let's at least ether myself just to keep myself ahead of the curve in case I have to regen again. Oh, I got a counterattack in there. Beautiful. Okay, absorbing health. That's not great. Okay, I already need to regen again. I don't even know if I have haste on right now. Yeah, my thing's still going up quite fast. My my uh, attack meter or whatever. Active time battle meter. Rene, increase lightning. She should be getting a new limit break sometime soon. Uh, I guess she still has to, like, even if she gets enough usage, she still needs to 
like kill a certain number of enemies to get it as well. Ba -ba! I'm assuming for beating this, I will get... Oh, Ice Ring. That's probably Ice Absorb. I'm assuming I'll get either her ultimate weapon or her ultimate um, limit break. Probably the limit break. I can't believe you beat me. Of course. This should be interesting. It's been too long since I've had a chance to use my full power. Well, get ready, buckaroo. Should I be talking to each of these ones after I finish? I, I think maybe I have been. can't remember. Boom, boom. Good enough. Okay. I should also be keeping track of what items they're giving me. Uh, ice ring. Nullifies cold attacks. What else should I get? Hopefully nothing that I forgot to check out. I don't see any new weapons for her yet. Oh, I got a turbo ether from the one. That's right. Um... Right on. It just nullifies it, doesn't even drain it. Not a big deal. I mean, still better than nothing if I need some ice resistance. Um, oh, let's talk to this friend. I can't believe you beat me. Believe it. Oh, each of these rooms has a different, like, Asian-looking symbol up on the wall. I wonder what those all mean. I wonder if the ones on the floor are the same or different, too. If anybody knows uh, that stuff, especially if you can actually read it yourself and can give me some of the context behind it, I would love that. The rule is the best flight fighter on each floor will be your opponent. This is a five-story pagoda, but the fourth floor is the highest. In other words, no one has ever defeated me. Master of weaponry. Okay. So we had speed. Or no, we had power, speed, magic, and now weaponry. What's the difference between power and weaponry? You still want to try? I like you. Now watch. Weapon change. All right. Whatever you say. Oh, we got one of these buggers. Okay. Hey, stop. Probably big damage incoming. But if a regen won't take care of, seemingly. Ba -na 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 -na. I mean, Bahamut. Inviting Bahamut into this pagoda is a little OP. But I mean, hey. He just comes down from a hole in the ceiling and it's like, yo. You told me I could just use my materia, so. Boom. Boom. Oh. Oh, we got a nice counterattack. Dude, by the end of the game, I'm going to have some really sick uh, materia combos. It's going to be fun. I, I forgot that you could do the multi-materia combos. Like, where you can have, like... Like, say you have three different Bahamut materials and you have one... Oh, wait! I haven't been noticing if Bahamut's been doing the HP absorb for me. I'll have to make sure that it's actually doing that and that you can use HP Absorb uh, with summons. But assuming it is, like, you can have... Beh or say you can have Fire. I know there's a, eventually you get a materia that's called, like, Quadra Magic, so you can cast a Magic four times. There's a ma uh, materia that you combine it with something and it makes Magic cost less. Uh, you could have it so that it does it to all enemies. You could do it with MP Turbo. You could have, like, your whole, like, weapons and armor where all eight combos are all, like, eight different properties on one piece of magic. And then you can just have one piece of magic that just goes nuts. It's very cool. Look, sir. What? Of course. Gorky. Splendid. You have definitely improved. Oh, you might not be as much of a child as we thought you were. Of course, if we lost to her... You have defeated four of our best, but now you will have to face him. So, I, I think the enemy skill that this final one has, and I think it's her dad, uh, but I think um, the, the final enemy, or the, the unique enemy skill that this guy has, I think it is just trying, which I obviously already have on this piece of um, uh, enemy skill materia, so I think it's not that it's only unique to this battle, but I think that the trine materia, or the trine enemy skill, can only got, be gotten from a, a few unique one-off battles, and I think this is the only one where you're able to do the battle after acquiring all four pieces of enemy skill materia, which I, I don't really mind that just having one. I, I don't even need to get an enemy skill materia full, quite frankly.
It's no, no sweat off my back if I don't. Uh, hey, Dad. Dad? Glad you made it this far, Yuffie. Why, why are you... I'll answer you by having you try your skills against me. Hold nothing back. Come as if you're trying to kill me. If you don't, then I'll have to kill you. Hey! How oh, she puts her arm up like that? Eh! What are you doing? Omni change! Okay, so we had power change, speed change, magic change, weapon change. Now we have omni change. We got the battle music kicking in. Let's go! Okay. Oh, that's a cool enemy design. Boom. Paste up. I don't know if you were trying to use some kind of uh, status ailment on me, but it ain't gonna work. I got the ribbon equipped, bruh. Oh, different heads? So, like, probably different... Oh, beasts, sorry. Probably different modes. So it can do everything. It can be fast, powerful, magic, weapon, whatever. Okay, regen. And now, I I'm gonna... Um, oh, crap. I forgot to... Okay, we'll use a turbo ether. Train. Not even that much. Okay, now I'll use uh, Bahamut, and I'll make sure to pay attention. Oh, crap. Yeah, good thing that won't work on me. Make sure to pay attention and see if, like, I actually absorb HP from this attack. Otherwise, I won't keep uh, HP absorb equipped uh, next to any summons. Uh, I think it did. I think I absorbed 10% of that. So, so that's pretty good. Hold on, I, I don't think I have regen on it anymore. Boom. Oh wait, did I just heal that thing? Nope, pretty good. I just was looking at the green of uh, the monster's hands and stuff. Beast sword! Roaring beast semblance. Shout out to anybody who's watched the uh, the anime uh, get backers. Okay, I need uh, another regen. <laughs> I love the way the thing moves around. Okay, you got strong healing yourself. I see. Oh, trying there it is. Yeah, I would love to use, um, I would love to use the laser enemy skill. Oh, crap, that did a lot of friggin' damage. I would love to use the laser enemy skill to, you know, use a gravity-based attack to try and really knock its health out. But, um... Dude, if it keeps healing itself this much, it's gonna be hard to get through. Oh, at least her limit break does... Oh, my God! Dude, it's so much friggin' healing, and I have to, like... Okay, the counterattack is going to help me a lot. Come on, man. I have to keep regening myself, otherwise I'm going to die for sure. And it can use Drain. Uh, it's a waste of a turn if it doesn't wind up working, but uh, I got to try. I got to try Laser. Oh, baby. Let's go. So it's only got 2,000 health left. Okay, I'm just gonna keep using laser until laser doesn't do that much anymore. Dude, my regen does not last. Man, that's such crap. Now I gotta risk, like, not doing up my regen so I can get more turns in. The counterattack helps incredibly. I should have saved Bahamut on this guy. Only 1,200. Ah, uh, that's another friggin' heal. Dude, this is crappy, man. What the hell is this crap? I, sh I really should have saved Bahamut, obviously. Like, what do I do? Uh, oh my god. Okay, let's use another Turbo Ether. Let's try and Bad Breath it. Bad Breath should try and inflict basically every status ailment all at once, so... Like, I need as many counterattacks as I can get. 
Oh, thank you. And maybe I'll just keep lasering. And then just, like, hopefully I can rely on the poison and the counterattacks to, uh, to finish it off. Oh, we're so close. Oh, limit break. Dude, but it's gonna heal. Okay, I'm gonna, I'm gonna fire off the limit break. Come on, another drain? Okay, we got a counterattack. We got two poison applications. Please. Yes! Oh, baby. Oh, my God, that was hard. Clear, tranquil, gained. Okay, so she got her second limit break. All creation, that's her final limit break. Friggin' right. That was a hard battle. <sighs> uh, old coot? Not bad. You've also improved. <laughs> Mutual respect. Love it. <laughs> what is he going to say? Ho ho ho? No. Ha ha ha. <laughs> what the hell was it that Don Corneo kept saying? I can't even remember. It was so stupid. Ha ha ha! Ah, they both love it. What is that noise? Is there a bird? I guess that was the sound of their laughter. It's time I gave this to you, Yuffie. <gasps> oh, baby! Now all of a sudden I'm super glad I came here. This is Leviathan materia. Take it. Oh, I wonder if I'll get the, sca the, the water scales, too. To go into the fire dungeon out back. But Lord Godo... Leviathan material should only be given to the person who conquers and takes over this pagoda. That is our custom. What do you think just happened, bro? Custom, custom, custom. I'm so sick of hearing that. It's so stupid. <laughs> Silence, Miss, Miss Yuffie. Yeah, exactly. Have, have some respect for, um, you know, for the old ways. Then what about all of you? With all your power, are you satisfying, satisfied with being cooped up in this tower? Well, I thought you were the one who wanted your hometown back to be more like it was. Yuffie. You too, Dad. Just because you lost the war, you turned Wu-Tai into a place like this? What do you mean? I thought you didn't want it to be a tourist attraction. What do you mean? You turned Wu-Tai into a cheesy resort town peddling to tourists. How dare you? Dachau statue and Leviathan are ashamed. This isn't a touristy part of the town. The Turtle Bar is. And people still need a place to go and have a bite to eat and drink. She is a kid. What did you say? <laughs> yeah, they're like, yeah, yeah, you guys still got some stuff to learn, Yuffie, even if you are a sick battler. Yuffie, forgive me, it's all my fault. What are you saying, Lord Goto? Losing the war turning Wu-Tai into this. It was all my fault. Lord Godo! Silence! Yuffie. I am the same now as I was before when I wanted war. But after losing, I began to think. Is strength from beating enemies? Or just something to show off? Might begets might. The same as Shinra. Live by the sword, die by the sword. But you obviously need some strength to protect yourself. I knew you were looking for materia for the good of Wu Tai. But the reason I hide my strength now is also for the good of Wu Tai. And now I realize both both are necessary. Right, that seems like a balanced perspective to have. Strength without determination means nothing, and determination without strength is equally useless. That's right. All action and no application or all all application and no action. Uh like the scene from uh, Waking Life, the incredible movie that every person on this planet should watch several times. Waking Life, directed by, written and directed by Richard Linklater, maker of Dazed and Confused and uh, Slackers and School of Rock, etc. 
he also made a movie recently that he had been working on for decades where he filmed like a, i think a guy and his son over the course of like 10 years or more he also made a scanner darkly the movie uh rendition of it anyhow lord godo you there please take yuffie with you i perceive that you all have both determination and strength Ah, seeing this fills you with determination. <laughs> Shout out to whoever gets that reference. After that, how can we refuse? Just don't do nothing funny to our ma materia, exactly. Go, Yuffie. For the sake of Wu Tai. Say something nice to your dad, Yuffie. <laughs> dad, aw. I'll take care of the five sacred gods until you return. Go, and come back alive. Duh. <laughs> oh, everybody's gonna leave him alone to have a little moment. Oh. Yeah. Yuffie, wait a minute. After the battle is over, do you think they'll still want all their materia? <laughs> Dad! Go! Fight till the end, but come back. With the materia. <laughs> like father, like, like daughter. So funny. <laughs> you bet. Uh, you better not fucking steal it from us, buddy boo-boo. What the fuck was that? Was that the suck it? For the Bud Light suck it from, from the early 90s? No. Just joking. Okay, so I definitely can't uh, use all creation until... Until she's got all of her other limit breaks. What one did she just earn? Whoops. Oh, restore HP of allies. Cool, cool. All right, well, that's enough Yuffie for now. But uh, that was that was a lot of fun. Um, crap. I shouldn't have unequipped. Oh, uh, I think it's fine. I don't think I uh, actually un inadvertently unequipped any materia. Okay, so let's try and replace this all as good as possible. Time was on Tifa. The other one on Tifa was Luck Plus. Counterattack was on Barret. So was Long Range. Uh, this was on Red. The, uh, HP Absorb. That is awesome that that actually works. Just any skill command. Uh, this was on Barretto. Cover, Counterattack. Uh, oh no, long range, sorry, long range was on red. This was magic plus, store, and we are back to good. Friggin' right. Thanks, Yuffie, that was awesome. Ba -na 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 -na. It's Yuffie, your feelings for Wu Tai is the same as Lord Godo's. Always remember that. Aww. Let's go talk to Lord Godo again. Oh, go! Fight till the end, but come back. Ma take care of Materia. <laughs> it's got a cool fucking stance there. It's like uh, a praying mantis stance, looks like. Oh, I gotta change party members. Can't forget that. Um, definitely do that. And... Oh, wait. Oh, baby. We got a new summon. Alright. <laughs> now... Uh, I wonder if I can go back out to that fire cave now, now that I have Leviathan. I'll, I'll give it a shot. Because Leviathan might be considered the water god that has the water god scales that the guy outside of this pagoda was talking about. Would make sense, considering I got it from here. Never bring shame on Wutai. You say there's some unusual material where the underground pipe is? Huh? But first you gotta get if from a monster and unless you won't unless you use your head you won't be able to do it underground pipe is that out back where the fire cave is underground pipe there's a monster and you have to use your head in order to defeat the monster that's like a weirdly phrased message from this guy i guess it, it, it sounds like it's trying to like emulate as if we're saying that to him and he's just repeating back what we're saying Miss Yuffie, we pray for your success. 
I guess we'll take a walk around town and look for an underground pipe. Have you heard of the Water God Scales? I mean... Does this have something to do with the water pipe? Underground pipe? Okay, I can't ring the gong anymore. Strangely. Whatever. Oh, well, underground pipe. Underground pipe, where are you, underground pipe? Anybody know any underground pipe calls? Yeah, these people are a little weird. The one talks about the meteor, that makes sense. The other two, I don't really know what they mean. Whatever. I guess they're just praying. In a way. Underground pipe. <laughs> Please. For the love of God, somebody tell me where the underground pipe is. Thank you, Yuffie. Um, yeah, let me just take a... Take a little wander around town. Look for an underground pipe. Underground pipe. Underground pipe. Underground pipe. Underground pipe. <laughs> a little off on a couple notes there. That's jazz, baby. Underground pipe. Underground pipe. Underground pipe. Underground pipe. Ah, uh, it's. Uh, I'm not. <laughs> I'm not that bad at picking notes, but the problem is I'm like not that good at singing different notes from the ones that I'm hearing. Otherwise, that might have, might have sounded a little better, but I kind of got pulled off of what my voice was trying to do. Anyhow. Um, yeah, I, I'm literally just holding L and R. Just need to find out if I can get back in here now. I, f I don't know. I, I give myself a 50-50 shot. I, I don't really know. Okay. I do not remember how to get the... I went up, up top, eh? I do not remember how to get the... Oh yeah, I did. I don't remember at all how to get the... Um, the Water God scales. I wish the enemies didn't get like way more attacks than I did. Feels kind of annoying. I can't believe Barrett doesn't um, have any additional limit breaks yet. It's kind of crazy seeming. Underground pipe. Where's the underground pipe? Uh, okay. I mean, if anybody knows about that underground pipe and wants to let me know, or about the water god scales, I'm open to friendly advice from observers. Uh, 44 minutes, so I'm pretty sure I know where to go. Well, let's go talk to this guy again. Why not? You again? Alright, what is it? I haven't been able to get the materials. I think this is the guy that if you start exploring the mithril cave or the mithril mines which I think are over here? 
I think these are the mithril mines, which you once again need, uh, in this case, a blue chocobo to get to. Um, and I think there's a bunch of stuff you can get by mining mithril and then bringing it to that guy. And I believe that's eventually how you get Eris's final limit break, which is obviously useless if you don't do it on the on the first disc. Uh, I'm trying to think of where else I could go right now. I wonder if I could um, complete this place. I do have a bunch of money. Okay, so I could think about doing that. There was another... Oh, I want to go back to... Gongaga? And just see if anybody says anything different here now. Now that we've uh, had the interesting experience of seeing that potentially it was not Cloud at the Nibelheim incident. See if we could maybe get some different info from... Oh, that woman is, is gone there now. You lost? When that happens, the only ones you can count on are your friends. First thing you gotta do is find your best friend. That's foreshadowing a thousand percent. A thousand percent, that's foreshadowing... Uh, like, let's read that again. You lost? When that happens, the only ones you can count on are your friends. It's like synchronicity that this guy is, like, telling this to them. He's thinking, oh, they're just lost as in... They're lost in this town. They don't know which way, you know, to get somewhere. Or, you know, they don't know that they... This isn't actually the town they need to be in. But that's like... It's kind of saying, like, you and the party lost. Like, you lost your friend. You know, you guys are lost wandering, you, like, you don't know exactly how to accomplish your goals. You don't know where your friend is, your friend is lost. The only one, what happen when that happens, the only ones you can count on are your friends. Find your best friend, yeah. Uh, I believe they are referring to Cloud there. Okay, so this lady is not at her husband's grave anymore. Livestream? Never heard of it. Planet structure? Who cares about that? Why don't you go ask Bugenhagen of Cosmo Canyon hard questions like that? Okay, so that's, I guess, a clue to head back to Cosmo Canyon. I don't think anybody starts selling anything different in this game. All good. Will you tell me any different stories? Looks like no, but I mean, a couple people changed stories in this place so far, so it's worth talking, everybody. Underground pipe. <laughs> ah. Children gather round. Today I will tell you a story that was passed down by my father and his father before him throughout generations. Our story of our family, our lineage, is one seemingly not that important, but it will affect the fate of all. It is the legend of the underground pipe. <laughs> Anybody watch um, Are You Afraid of the Dark when you were a kid? I freaking love that show. I submit for the approval of the Midnight Society, the tale of the underground pipe. All right, Haro. Nothing new, eh? Nothing new. Shucks. Shucks howdy. Huh. <laughs> Just a fucking hole in the ground. Let's go back there. Yeah, it's 49 minutes. I I'm gonna make this be my last, um... Last episode of the night, so I'm purposely not going to the town where I know I need to go next. Um, because I just don't want to get invested into some big long cutscene or something. Uh... Just kind of, you know what? I will end since since I'm so pleasantly pleased with the fact that I got a new um, summon out of that side quest. I'm gonna go somewhere else that I know I also will get another new summon. Um, I don't know if it's time to do it yet. 
I could go kick the Midgar Zolems, but again. Um, but Fort Condar. I get a new summon out of this place whenever I defeat the final mission there. I don't know if I'm, I don't know if there's more than just two missions. Or what? But uh Regardless, there's at least two, and I've already defeated one. Got a lot of money. So, uh, I'm just going to check it out. If there is a new mission to do here, I'll kind of talk to everybody and do all the prep work, and then I'll just save, uh, and I'll continue tomorrow and, and start with that. Ask my son, who's standing guard at the shed, about anything related to our military tactics. All right, we'll, we'll just go straight up to this guy and see if there's a new new thing he wants us to do. Okay, I can't actually go out there. All right. Just making sure. Sometimes it's hard to face the directions you need to face. Ooh, condor! Oh, come on. How goes it? The Shinra troops have attacked nine times since you were here! Oh my god! So we're getting a little short on funds. We have zero gil right now. I'll give them a lot. I don't know if this actually matters, them having a surplus of cash, but... Okay, fair enough. Okay, so there is another battle. <laughs> oh my god, that's heartbreaking. Shinra's attacked nine times since you were last year. Holy frig. So I will definitely battle for them. And, I mean, hopefully I, uh... I, I'm pretty sure the end of it is like the Condor's egg hatches. So hopefully that gets to happen. I don't know if that, that'll happen now or if I'll have to wait till the third disc or something. Okay, let's, let's get stocked up. Clearly I needed a, a lot of these, so let's just keep getting those. Even Phoenix Downs. Like, but now that I have a lot of money, let's just get really well stocked up. Boom. I mean, if it, oh my god. You know what? Why not? Why not? That's good. Oh, I, I flipped out for a second. I was like, oh my god, is this the place with the HP plus, MP plus materials? Nope. New. Um, yeah, I don't need any of that. Oops. This is cool music, too. Na 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 na. Hey, let's get some rest. Cool. All right. Yeah, I'm going to call it here. I'll save, and then uh, episode 49 that I start tomorrow, I will I will help these guys battle again. I'll sp oh, I only have 23,000 gold now. Hopefully that's enough to buy enough troops to win the next battle. If not, then I'll just have to win it with my battle, like my actual party. But it would be cool to win it in the... Um, Whatchamacallit? What the hell am I trying to say? The real-time strategy game. Um, yeah, so thanks for watching. Let me know what you think of everything that's going on. Let me know what you think of uh, the, the the battle tower that I just took on in uh, in Wutai there and the relationship between Yuffie and her father. Um, let me know if I'm missing something that you think I should, uh, that I should get. Uh, that's about it. Hope life's going well for you. Uh, like, comment, share, subscribe, all that good stuff. And let me just save 12 more times to assuage my paranoid mind. And uh, yeah, I will see you in episode 49. Peace out.